Told you, this thing is bigger than Nino Brown, and I got a list of proof. If I'm going down, I'll take court. a whole lot of people with me. Order in the court. Order in the court. Gotti, I don't want. I don't want to make this long. I don't want to make this long. I got. A, I got a couple things to say. I don't. I don't want to get on the internet, talk crazy. You know what I mean? No question. You feel me? No question. But this, I like the way this look. This could be like a a new podcast. We could call this Back Talk. What you think? Like that. Back of the back. Back of the back. Feet up. Like. That. I, mean, I like that new podcast on the way. I might come on YouTube and talk like how these niggas talk. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. Hit the like button. Hit the share button. <laughs> Listen, Troy, you're a very funny guy, man. You always been funny. You always amused me. I, I, I always thought that you was comical. I never took you serious. I never thought I, I never believed none of this shit. None of us ever did. We, we, we never believed you. The only person ever thought that you was important was you, brother. Um, you never was nobody. Um, so I said all that to say, not to put you down, but to say to you. This narrative about people hating on you, everybody hating on you, everybody against you. I'm not against you. I don't hate on you. I've never hated on you. I've never had a problem with you because guess what? You could never have been a problem with me. You could have never been a problem for me. All right? So with that being said, I just want to tell you, listen, I, I've, been, I've, been, I've been holding something for you because I, I, I figured that maybe at some point you would uh you would believe so much of these 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 tall tales about yourself that you would maybe one day I would have to put you black back in your place because prior to this we, we it was all good you was a little nigga that I met at the gas station handing out the CDs I never seen no bands never seen no jury never seen none of that but listen who am I to judge everybody everybody got a a, a, a road to follow so I never had issues with you but now you know. After all these bricks and in, 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 in these backpacks, after all this talk. That was cement. What, cement? <laughs> no, listen, listen. After all this talk, these bricks and these backpack, you, you, you're talking so crazy and you're talking about this money and you're talking about this jury and all that. Brother, you should never talk money and jury, please. Because I bought something for you that I've been holding. I've been keeping it on ice for a long time, you know? I'm, I'm going to show you what it is. I've been holding this because I, I, I figured at some point that I would have to put you back in your place. Awesome. And it's cold. Sure have. Brother. We kept Ab, it on real ice. Kept it on. <laughs> <laughs> I've been holding this for you. Do you remember this? is your Jesus piece. This is the Jesus piece that you wore every single day. You got up, you went to video shoots with. You got up, you put this around your neck. You went to... Um, you went to parties with this, you went to industry events, you went to all, uh, you did shows with this on, you took a lot of pictures with this on right here. Um, anybody that's watching this can find, can find out that you can, you can easily find pictures of this same, the same chain um, around your neck, right? Um, the thing, the, the, the significant thing about this chain, because I don't want people to think, oh man, oh grimy, yeah, this chain. This is the chain that, that Troy Ab was wearing when he was, uh, you know, got into his, his, his scuffle at, uh, at Urban Plaza. Um, and the reason why I held this chain is because, not because I didn't want to give it back, because I just felt like, you know, maybe, maybe, maybe one day I will have to like step on him a little bit and, and remind him who he really is. Right. Um, the reason why I held this chain is not because I didn't want to give it back, but, but the chain is fake. This is fake. This is a fake chain. This is this chain that you wore every single day. This chain is fake. You wore this chain every fucking day. And I know y'all gonna say, oh, that's not his chain. He gonna say that's not his chain. But guess what? You, they gonna say we photoshopped it. <laughs> they gonna say, they gonna say we photoshopped it. They gonna Mano came with a chain and photoshopped it because he trying to, he's he hating on, 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 on Troy Ave. I, 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 I have no reason. My life's been good. I've been doing my thing, I'm cool. I'm not the greatest nigga in the world, but I'm definitely not the lowest on the totem pole. You know, life's been good. Um, but yeah, the thing is this. The reason why I'm pointing this chain out is, 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 to, is to show you that you, you have been a, you've been a liar since day one, right? You've, you've, you've built a, a, a small career on, on lies. You've, you've built everything on lies. You, any man that get up every day and put this hunk of dark ass metal, this is food. This is horrible. You can't. You, what is this? What? What? Gotti? What is this? What? What is this? What the fuck? This is a piece. This is a piece of shit. This is a. This is. 
God. This is a piece of shit. Like any man that put this on every single day and goes out to parties, goes in bitches' faces, goes to the studio, goes to these events, is a liar. You're a liar. You are a liar. You, you, you have not stopped lying yet. And I'm not trying to put you down. I'm just trying to show you who you're really not. Right? You said you 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 said things, and and it's like why why would you say that? Because all the only thing I ever said about you was and I and I didn't I didn't mean you no disrespect. I just told you that, or or rather I just said that I didn't agree with the the narrative that was being put out there about what took place. And I stand on that. I was there. I don't agree with the narrative, but now you gotta give an explanation of why. You spent your whole career wearing fake jewelry. Why we we what the fuck is this? And don't say it's it's not right because then I don't want to make another video, but the next one is gonna be me hooking up with one of your one of your homies and taking this to the jeweler to prove to everybody that it is. So I don't want I don't even want to do that. I don't want to do that. This is anybody know me that they they, I, they very rarely hear me talk. They very rarely ever hear me address niggas. You understand? I don't want to dress you. This is not a beef between me and you. I'm not looking for you, right? It's not going to come to that because we, we already understand what, what pressure is to you. What pressure is to you is that you become the prosecution star witness. We seen that. We witnessed that. I don't want no smoke with that. Cool. I'm not looking for you. This is about me giving you game. There was a time when you used to call me, right? You remember that? Remember those days? You used to say to me, big homie, yo, how you how you move around the industry, man? Like like how you deal with all this fake shit? And I used to give you advice. I used to talk to you because you was all right. I talked to you like the little homie that you was. So I'm I'm a, I'm not gonna talk down to you like you are out because you're not. Like I said, you never can never have a problem with you because you're not a problem for me. You couldn't do nothing with me. All right. So with that being understand understood, I'm gonna give you some game. This is not about beef. This is nothing to see here, right? This is about accountability. This is about the fact that you made a decision to run down on 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 a, on an op or whatever it is, and, and and you had a friend. Your friend was was very was a very loyal brother, and you know, uh, uh, pursuant to your decision, um, your friend your friend lost his life. And I've yet to see you have any amount of re uh, of a remorse for that. And, and and brother, as a as a as a leader, we all have the the uh, responsibility to make sure that. When um when we go out, that we make sure everybody that we wake get home safely. I've I've yet to hear you say, yo, damn man, I made that I made that call, and and some some of that blood is on my hands, right? You you everybody's to blame but you. Every everybody did it but you, right? And and I want you I want you to listen to me very carefully. No, I'm the type of nigga that if if I run into a nigga that I, that I got an issue with. Yeah, I'm going to get with it, right? But the difference between me and you is that I'm going to stand on whatever it is, right? You can't make that decision, right? And when the decision don't go your way, you, you cry victim. This is this is what the issue is. You're crying victim. You're saying, oh, he did this, this. Oh, niggas tried to assassinate me. Niggas, haters wanted to kill me. I, I'm a superhero. I took I took the gun and, 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 and shot at the, That's not true. You, you didn't take the gun. The gun was tossed. That's okay. All right, follow me. Follow me. You didn't take the gun. The gun was tossed. So follow me, right? Um. There's a there's a there's a sense of accountability that 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 you should have when you when you when you're dealing with your friends losing their lives, right? Because I never want to put my friend in a situation where he loses his life and then I gotta face his brother. Because if I did, if there was if it was me, then I would be it is it is family's. In his family's face with a, with, a, with a different attitude. I wouldn't be sitting in jail making rhymes, rapping over the phone, none of that. Because I would, I, it, it would be a little, bit, a little bit deeper for me if this was a friend of mine. Right? So the real, truth, the real truth is that you're not saying is that because of your decision, your friend died, brother. Unfortunately. Unfortunately. And, and, and now you're making videos about why, why I have something to say. Well, here's what people don't know. You was in a courtroom mentioning my name, right? And and I know why you was mentioning my name because I finally figured out what your issue is with me, right? You know what his issue is with, with me? What? 
His issue with me is that, because well, first of all, let me tell you what he said in court. He said, uh, Mano was running back and forth. Um, this is what he said on the stand. Mano, 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 was, Mano was going back and forth, um, not caring whether, whether uh, Banger was, was dead or alive. And, and I understand why you said that. Because when you, when you came out the room, um, I, and you was like, somebody help me, somebody help me pick him up. I told Rick, I had told Rick, nah, don't, don't lift him up, put him, like, don't lift him up. And I think that he took that as if I was like, fuck this nigga. But I wasn't. And I know he never really been in no real shit before. But any nigga that really been in some gunplay, I understand this, no, though. When when you, when you somebody get hit, you don't move them, right? You don't move them because you don't know where you hit at. And and let's be real. We four flights up. Where you, you going to take them down the steps? So that was, I think, what the, what, the, what the underlying issue was of why he got on the stand and brought my name up and why he got this. Because I've been seeing little sneak shit for years. It's not even relevant to that case. And don't, but it, it don't matter because it's relevant to him, though. He been he been little sneaky little shit, little, going a little, saying a little sneak shit. Oh, his girl got hit and he ain't do nothing. But, and here's another thing: when you when you when you never when you never really been involved with no real gunplay, then and you never really, you know, I, come on, this this guy's like what a uh, um, a good kid to come from a decent home, right? We, we we never heard of. We don't know nothing about these other stories. We don't know nothing about no drug dealing. We don't know no 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 niggas that know him. None of that, right? So I get that he don't really understand, and the people that he talking to don't understand. Because guess what? When you're growing up and you playing with them pistols, you're gonna have some you're gonna have some issues, right? I personally hit two of my niggas by mistake. We friends to this day because the intent wasn't there. Right? You know I wasn't trying to hurt him, right? But that's that's all street shit, right? When you're talking about this specific case right here, let's be honest, you got three, four niggas fighting over one over one pistol and it go off and other people getting hit. Right? Those bullets wasn't meant for them. Right? You talking about, oh man, you left the girl. Nigga, I was the last person in the place. I was the last person. I was the last rapper in Urban Plaza, bro. If I watched all you niggas leave. I watched you frantic. I, wa I watched all you niggas leave. I watched tax leave. I watched everybody leave. But you know why? You know why I was the last one? The last one there because for people that don't understand, Urban Plaza is not a club. It's a concert hall. I was there to perform. If you, if anybody finds this, this uh. The flyer from Irvin Plaza, that they would see that me and Uncle Uncle Murder names was on the bill. Now, Irvin Plaza is a concert hall, not a club. We were in the green room, right? The the the, the waiting area, right? It's two it's two rooms. It's the room that me and o Uncle Murder is occupying, and then there's a joining room that Ti is in. 85% of the people that was in that room was with us. That was with me. I had maybe 15, 20 people with me. I made sure that all my guys was going was out, right? So now, when the whole shit happened, we the only niggas running back. We the only niggas running back. I didn't, where, where was I going? I couldn't lead a girl. I stayed to the end. Niggas, yo, man, come on, let's go. I can't leave shorty because she here with me. So we, 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 we got 80. We made sure we got 80. We got everybody that came with us, and I stayed to the end. I stayed so long that the fucking cops was there. And then I had to sneak out because they was looking for statements. Hey, what, what did you see? I ain't seen nothing. I, I heard shots. I got the fuck out of there. I'm not, I'm not a police. I'm not trained to run towards gunplay. Niggas, You know? I say all that to say this, though, like, the narrative and the lies is just is just uh is just flowing, it's just ongoing, right? And right, so we stayed, I was the last rapper on the scene. The last rapper. Paramedics was there by the by the by the time I left. They took they took Shorty. We got 80 down the steps. He was going, everybody was going, everybody's going, all you niggas was going, nobody was in the building. All you niggas was gone. 
I had because the police was trying to keep us in there, I had to sneak out. Fuck out of here. I'm not giving these niggas no statement. And I went to the hospital and that was that. And I talked about all this shit on um on on you you know throughout the years, right? But like I said, this is not a this is not a uh it's not a beef between me and you, brother. I don't beef with niggas that wear shit like this. This isn't this is this is stupid. This is stupid. And it's even more stupid for you to to try to make yourself believe or make anybody else believe that you this nigga that you're not. Come on, man. I, which, we, we all too old to be beefing on the internet, my nigga. We all too grown for that. Right? This ain't, this ain't that. This is not that. You not that. So this is not that. And I don't take nothing away from your manhood. You holding, you holding yourself down. You defending yourself. It's all cool. You on your hustle. I always liked your hustle. I have nothing against you. But right is right, wrong is wrong, right? We not gonna we not gonna continue to go back and forth about about what my opinion is, right? My opinion is is the fact you niggas came in with the energy, it didn't go right the way you wanted to go, and that's that, right? I'm not saying you wrong for having the energy. I'm saying just what it is. So if you came in with the energy, stand on the energy. Your 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 reasons for telling. Your reasons for getting on the, on the stand is because what? It's for two reasons. One, you wanted to get out of that situation with with you, with the guns that you was caught with, right? So that was that was your inspiration and your motivation for getting on the stand. Also, what a lot of people don't know is that in order for you to, to win that lawsuit that you got in, you got to be a victim. Oh, we know about all that. Yeah, anything we know about that, we know about that too. We know about that. We know about that. You 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 have this. You 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 trying to pursue a lawsuit. So that in order in order to win the lawsuit, you can't be in a. You, you gotta be. You can't be a perp. You gotta be. You gotta prove that you was a a, a victim, right? And um, you 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 worked out a deal with the, with the DA, right? To get. I don't know. He recommended what one year when you was facing way more than that or whatever. Those the guns that you had. That's that's the reason why you you told it is because the truth of the matter is you could have you could have not got on the stand and whatever was going whatever was meant to happen was going to happen right i'm not i'm not here to condemn you for for all that i'm not running around saying yo this nigga's a rat fuck this nigga i have never said none of these things about you brother i'm just telling you what you're not you're obviously not a a rich nigga that wears real jewelry case in point <laughs> You need to explain why we got all these pictures of you in this same chain, right? And I'm, I'm going to keep bringing up the chain because this is just unbelievable that, that you, you're sitting up there talking about money and jewelry. You're sitting up there talking about, oh, my diamonds, my gold is more than this and this and that. And you, you, you're talking about, oh, failed rappers and, and like... And it's something is really wrong with you when you when you when you continuously make these claims, this this fail rappers as if you've been on the charts for <laughs> for ten years. Like what 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 moral Rapper. high ground are you standing on? Like where where are you? Like you 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 uh, you lit? Like you some greatest rapper? Like you 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 calling other niggas fail rappers, brother? Like and that is a sign of like delusion right nice. and i want to tell because a lot a lot of these people egg him on and they shouldn't because what what we need to be doing is trying to get this man some help because there's something wrong with him obviously because like i said any nigga that's getting up every fucking day and putting this on and going in front of niggas is acting like they, they the realest nigga in the world something wrong with him something is wrong with him you got the audacity the audacity, the nerve, the nerve to speak on who? On me? What you gonna say? Oh, you old nigga, this and that, all that. Oh, you ran out your shit. What, all, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? You're a liar. You can't beat me with lies. Not as long as I got this, because you can't even. What's the excuse? Because you were said you you said you was rich then. You said you made all this money off off drugs then, and this is what you was, you was wearing. 
It was a white Christmas every year. Yeah, right. But What's you was wearing that. You was wearing that, man. I don't. <laughs> I don't want to do this, man. This is. This is. I've not. I've not. I've not. I've not done some shit like this in so long that it's 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 crazy. And I think a lot of times when 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 people be throwing shots, because I've I've watched niggas take shots at me for a couple years, and I've not said not one thing. And I, I I've allowed niggas to bite on my skin, and I'm not I'm so official. I don't straight I straight I don't straight out no rumor on me. Yo, man, they said you did okay. I don't straighten out no rumor on me. But you, not you, dog, not you, nigga. Not you. You been on my dick, nigga. You was chasing me around trying to get features with me since you came out. Stop it. You in court mentioning my name. Stop it. Stop it. Bricks in my backpack. Hmm? What edition was this? It was concrete. Man. This is what is this? What is this made out of? Die cast metal. This is crazy. This is a toy. This is a piece of shit. I'ma hold on to this though. Because y'all gonna say it's it's fake. They gonna, they gonna say it's fake, got it? They gonna say it's bullshit. He know it's real, though. They gonna say that's not the chain. He but it, it's real. it's it's so many pictures where you can pull up and that's the chain. Hold on, matter of fact, because I don't know how to switch the screen and all that. I don't know, I'm not that savvy, right? I'm gonna pull up pictures. Mm. Oh, look at this. Me and you, nigga. Huh? Ain't that the chain, nigga? That's it. <laughs> That's it. That's it. Yeah, you, you've you been wearing this for quite some time, brother. I implore anybody that is, is does not believe what I'm talking about to do your homework. To do your homework. Here, you want to wear it? <laughs> I don't know, but that's in the garbage. <laughs> Any nigga that put this shit on and come outside and tell you niggas that he he got all this money and he a millionaire is, is crazy, man. And and the thing, don't talk money, my nigga. Don't talk money when 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 Africa was crying to me about you owing them money. Stop stop playing with me. Stop playing. Don't talk money. Don't talk money to me, man. You never seen me in a crisis before. You, 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 stop it. Stop it, man. Stop it, man. And like I said, brother, this ain't this. I'm not gonna get on here and talk crazy. I'm not gonna get up here and disrespect you. I'm not gonna talk crazy. I'm just gonna show you who you're not. You're not that. You're not that. You're not that, right? I'm not not looking for you. Not gonna. This is not gonna happen. It's nothing to see here. But what we should do is, is is all get together, try to get you some help, because somewhere here is 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 something is missing. There's no way in the world a nigga is this grand, grandioso, this gangster, but yet he's he's not accepted no responsibility, no accountability for his own death, for the death of his own friend. Yeah. Rest in peace, banger. You know? And it, and, 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 and the thing, you know how they say it on, on the internet? How they say it? Let's get to that. Let's get to that. <laughs> Shout out to Zip. <laughs> Let's get to that. There was a... This this something that I never I never told anybody is the mm -hmm. fact that a couple of weeks before this this thing even happened I don't know how long maybe a week or so before this happened, Banger called me from jail. Mm -hmm. This is all, this is word of my mother. Banger called me to jail and had and had conversations with me about Troy Ave, about Troy Ave. So to see this happen, this is a, this is a fact. They are gonna tell you it's fake, but this is a fact. To see that this happened and to see that he lost his life um, is unfortunate because he told me some shit. Um, and I understand he felt he felt some kind of way about not getting bailed out, and he, and he was venting to me. I got it. And then he got back out here and he got with a nigga because guess what? He was loyal. He was loyal. He was loyal. So I understand. You know what I mean? But rest in peace to him. I never I never had no problem with Banger. Actually, me and Banger was cool. I had respect for him. Um, so when you, when you get up in court and you and you and you think that I I was I didn't care about Banger being dead or alive, that's not true. Um, you know, I just know that. There's no moving, moving a nigga when he hit. We didn't know where he was hit at, so moving him could have made it worse. I just know that that's not the that's not the move to make. You know, um, I grew up understanding that. I know that you don't understand that. You don't understand that because that's not what you, that's not actually what you come from. So, um, we gonna we 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 gonna, we gonna leave it like that though. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna keep 
you know, beating a dead horse. Um, you should not even, you should not even talk no more though, brother. Like, don't even talk because until you can explain why you spent 85% of your career wearing this, you might, you might be getting money now. But guess what? I, I don't, if you was a liar then, nine times out of time, nine times out of 10, you still a liar now, right? You, you just don't turn that shit off. If you was a liar then, nine times out of 10, you are a liar now. I, I don't think that you're not a liar. Your whole, your whole image, everything has been a lie. Everything has been a lie. Nobody knows you, brother. You've never been, you never, you're not one of them guys. I understand. I understand. You're not one of those guys. Not one of those guys, man. You know? But I get it. You was a little nigga that that, that has some grind. And we commend you for that. We commend you for your grind. But you also was a little nigga wearing dark ass metal. <laughs> Who's to say that you're not wearing that shit now? But yet you on videos talking about your your gold and your diamonds and, the, and how rich you is, yo, ch chill out, bro. Cause come on, man, you, come on, man, come on with all this, man. People streets out there, is start, a myth. yeah, the st streets is a myth. Streets is a myth, bro. brother. The only myth is you, man. You, you, you've proven to be the myth. You've proven to be a liar. You've proven to be everything that you say that you wasn't. You've proven that. You know what I mean? But like I said, I'm, I'm not gonna keep beating a dead horse. I don't wanna. I don't want to. Um, I don't. I don't. I don't want to make this more, more painful than it always is. Why don't you put this on and pose it real quick? No, throw that shit in the garbage. This is crazy. You. This is what you win. This is. This is. This is. This is your. This is it. Look at this. This is it. This is it. This is it. Huh? This is uh, it. Man. <laughs> and I know. Sh and listen, I know shit about you that you don't think I know. Chill out. Chill out, man. Get your money, man. Do what you do. Do what you do.